Now, back to rockets. If you wanted to travel into space, you need the backing of a government, and a rich government at that. But it's all starting to change. The 21st century is heralding the arrival of the Rocketeer Privateer. On the 21st of June 2004, Spaceship One went rocketing into the history books. When it became the first privately funded manned vehicle to make it into space. It was carried to an altitude of nearly 14 kilometers by its launcher, White Knight, before it broke free and fired its own rocket engine. Although it only burned for 80 seconds, the rocket produced enough thrust to send the tiny craft hurtling 100 kilometers above the Earth. To come down, the wings were tilted and Spaceship One flew effortlessly to Earth. Fortunately, our pockets aren't quite as deep as Richard Branson's. Branson. Branson, mate. Oh, right. I thought it was a guy who made the pickle. Anyway, how much have we got? 30 quid, 30 quid. But with some creative thinking, I think we can come up with something. Yeah. So Johnny and I have come up with a pressurised water rocket. You can make these at home. What you need is an air pump that supplies the pressure. You need a bicycle valve from an inner tube, a section of wine cork screwed in there like that. That's the clever bit. A bit of water, a stand, and obviously the rocket, which is my mini V2. Getting the ratio of water to air right is crucial. Richard reckons a two-litre bottle filled with a third of water should launch it to a good height. When the cork can't withstand the air pressure anymore, you have a liftoff. Four, five, oh, yes! Whee! That's 50 feet. It's a good one. Johnny, next one. Not bad, Rich, but I think I can do better. I've got a bigger pump and a bigger rocket. Richard's rocket took about 80 pounds per square inch before it went off. That's around three times the pressure of a car tyre. Come on. You could sell this as an exercise. It's absolutely knackering. With this bigger pump, Johnny is hoping for 100 psi, but there's no quick way of getting it in there. Oh! oh my God. I didn't see how high it went because I was facing the other way. But it sounded pretty good. How it was, was it? Excellent. It went rocketing off in that direction. You probably cleared 50 feet, but it went a lot. 50 feet at an angle? Yeah. That was excellent. But I've got something bigger than that, mate. Stand clear. I've got a fat one, and I've got a bad boy to fire it up. Now stand back. The compressor is providing 120 times more pressure than Johnny's foot pump. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. That was superb. Spectacular. We're not going into outer space with this one. No, but if we've got a big enough bottle, yep. strapped a couple of car seats to it. Yeah, I like the way you're thinking. We might make the upper atmosphere. Hey, come on, let's try. 